Right in the heart of Leicester, one of the UK's top ten cities to live and work in, lies Leicester Castle Business School. This is a new kind of institution, created by De Montfort University Leicester to provide students with the skills needed to become shapers and leaders in global business in the 21st century. It also heralds the start of a new chapter for one of the city's most important historic buildings, the Great Hall of Leicester Castle, where the school will be based. This landmark building has played host to kings, dukes and literary legends since the 12th century. Now it will be the home of high-caliber students from around the world, offering a unique and inspirational learning environment. A sympathetic £4.2 million programme will see the Great Hall and its environs restored to its former glory, and this is our vision of what that transformation will achieve. The main entrance area will have lift access to all floors. To its right is the Old Civil Court, a flexible space that can be used for lectures, discussions and guest speaker events. Looking at this magnificent room, it's easy to imagine the Great Hall in its glory days. Despite later changes to the structure, the hall is claimed to be the oldest surviving aisled and bay-divided timber hall in Britain. We are thrilled to have the chance to restore this building, a key part of the city's heritage, and share its fascinating legacy with students, staff and the people of Leicester. It's inside these very walls that our students will be prepared for careers with global businesses. Evidence of the castle's past is everywhere, with the former criminal court being transformed into a lecture theatre based on the Harvard style. The student spaces you will see with their soft furnishings will be ideal for informal discussions and group work. while the old evidence vault will provide a space for small groups and seminars. As students embrace new ideas and cutting-edge technology in this special setting, they will feel part of something that's much bigger than they may feel in a traditional learning environment. Originally, this space would have been the residence of the Earls of Leicester, and over the past nine centuries, the Great Hall has welcomed royal visitors, including... Edward I, Edward II and Richard III, and hosted lavish entertainment. It has seen violence and revolts, and also dispensed justice as the city's civil and criminal courts. Under the leadership of Professor Dana Brown, Leicester Castle Business School will be brought back into use to offer a portfolio of courses with an emphasis on unique elements, utilising expertise from across De Montford University and tapping into our valuable industry links. The courses on offer will be as inspirational as the learning environment itself. Our bespoke programme includes two new undergraduate options, Global Leadership and Management and Global Finance, and four new master's degrees, Business Management and the Creative Industries, Business Management and Sport, Global Investment and Risk, and Global Banking and Finance. Seminars for these exciting courses, along with business-style meetings, will take place in this second-floor boardroom. The city's heritage is all around, with the Leicester Castle Business School connecting the city of today and tomorrow with its medieval past. The castle's basement provides access to the rear of the building. You can see the beautifully landscaped castle gardens, which were originally part of the castle complex and lead down to the tranquil river Saw. This oasis is just a short stroll from the centre of a city that has attracted worldwide attention as the final resting place of King Richard III and the home of the 2016 Premier League champions Leicester City. The club have named De Montfort University as their official higher education partner, a deal which brings hundreds of opportunities for our students at the King Power Stadium. This is just the start of a thrilling journey for Leicester Castle Business School and you can find out more by visiting our website at www.lcbs.ac.uk.